Welcome back, Vampire, to another episode of me trying not to get myself killed for the second and final time. I have been standing in this diner for approximately two days, as have everyone else. And, uh, yeah. Surprisingly, that pizza is uneaten. The way things are going here in this country, you can't pass up free food like that. Or free blood, in my case. And Doris, you've been a sweetheart to deal with me. Have a free joke on me. Do you need help? Do you need help? They're asking the wrong person. Here, you laugh too. <laughs> well, on a serious note, we've made a slight crack. Secretary runoff congealing at the door. Yes, I am. From Lily's things, we found a bail bond. Gaze upon me and see reflected the contempt of your savior! To mock me is to scorn the Lord's love! The damned laugh loudest before they lose their heads! He's right. He is 100% correct about that. Oh, uh, well. Really? I couldn't. I couldn't capture a. Uh, a few blo wow, he just came out of nowhere. Wow. This is not going well according to my at all. This is all your fault. If I can get these guys to follow me down a hallway or something. Never pass up free blood, even if it's in the middle of combat. That's the best time. Alright, you just chill there. Wow, they didn't see that, they were looking right at me. No, wait. Not even three minutes into this, already I'm in trouble with the cops again. This is not voting well for me. The police are hunting. Mm. What if I just stay here? What if I make him laugh insanely? You should check on him. He may not be well. Is that another cop? I think that's another cop. Yeah, it's a cop. That's okay. They're not actively hunting me anymore. I think I can work my way around this. That was quick. Anyways. Hello, I don't care. I need to find him so he can find him. It's 250 grand of my money on the line here. Look, look, I'll talk to you later, okay? Damn, Let me Martha. know if you hear anything about either. 250 grand? Hello there. How you been? Uh, I like how he says it like he knows me. Welcome to Kilpatrick 24 Hour Bail Bonds. My name's Arthur Kilpatrick. How can I help you? Are you the key master? Huh? Oh, I, I see what you're yapping about. Yeah, I guess you could call it that. Key master, huh? Might be worth trying. <laughs> Where's Arthur the Kilpatrick, gatekeeper? <laughs> the Santa Monica key master. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. It sounds kind of like a bad horror movie. Or a good one. Let's see. Can I pluck some answers from your head? Sure, pal. What is it? 
Have you heard of the Shadow Cloaked Killer? Yeah, they're saying there was a murder down by the pier just like the one the other day down in Long Beach. Just vicious. Tore him up. They're saying it's a serial killer. Is tonight a rerun? What shall the donut eaters do? Well, I'm glad my character thinks about as well of him as I. Well, typically when things like this happen, the cops ratchet up the patrols and start hauling in more suspicious types. Could be good for me. My brain has questions that need your brain's answers. Sure, pal. What is it? Seriously, what do people think when they talk to my character? Tell me of this business of bonds and bounties. Bail bonding? What do you want to know? Are there many bounties to hunt? Of course. Goes with the business. Then you sick the bounty hunter on him. Ooh, a somewhat normal sentence. That's got to be an interesting job. You betcha. I used to do some bounty hunting myself back in the day. Takes a solid set of brass balls to make a good bounty hunter, I'll tell you that much. Does your hunter have good balls of brass? Yep, damn good. His name's Carson, and he's great at what he does when he wants to do it. I can't seem to find him now, though. He's pissing me off, to be honest. I need him to go find someone. Maybe you need a different set of brass balls. Well, I don't feel right cutting Carson loose just yet. We go way back. I knew his father, too. Tell you what, since I'm stuck here, why don't you go look for him? Just real quick. I'll pay you for your time. I will happily hunt the hunting one. Great, great. I suppose the first place you should look is his apartment in Santa Monica Suites. Apartment one, I think it is. Maybe you'll find something there to let you know where he's got himself to. Here's a key card. That'll let you in. I bet, Merc I bet Mercury still hasn't cleaned up that blood. Let's see. What the I have more sure, pal. What is it? From my brain. Well, that's not really much of a question. It's a statement. I am no longer here. Well, if he's not going to answer, nice work environment. I suppose I'll just look it up. What's the name on that? Rolf Totin. And the talking pig, and even the talking car in that show. You know the one I'm talking about. But now prepare for the most hilarious talkingest normally mute object yet. There He's is. Steve Cash, a New York banker and recent woodlark down on his luck. And ten August twenty second, two thousand three. Immigration. I happen to have a glandular problem. That's it. I'm withdrawing bond amount, all fifteen thousand. I think you only got to pay ten percent of a bond before She's you can make She's an ATM machine with the soul of his dead wife. Which never made sense Something to me. familiar about this ATM If you can pay machine, only ten percent of it. Why would you pay the full amount? So that the What's the point of the full amount? Me today. Really? She wasn't Go back to Germania. When she pushed my buttons, she was very gentle. Oh, honey, if Ooh. you don't stop, when I'm gonna have to make buttons. a deposit. Anyways, I Friends think I got a new Wednesday from that. Yeah, red lightning bird. 77. Guy Connie. Perhaps you can find his car. No, I will find his car. I wish I knew who I was listening to when I get those random messages. Is it like my interior voice? It, am I listening to like some other Malkavian on a different part of the planet? I have seen the face of the demon. <laughs> hey guys, you're not looking for me. Yet. <laughs> it's only a matter of time. Well, that's a little on the nose, MJ. Flip this open, and inside we have old Wrenchy and a diary. What's the diary got to say? It seems to be a woman's diary. I met a guy today at the asylum. He's so beautiful, oh my god. His name is Rolf and he's from Germany. 
European man is just so classy compared to boring California boys. He asked to see me tomorrow night. I wonder if he's rich. He looks rich. Seriously, you're going straight for rich. God damn it. This is why you got... <sighs> I'm going shopping tomorrow. Pick something up that'll make me look like... Won't make me look like a big fat pig. Like, she's borderline, like... Skeletal when you find her as it is. So tiny. I think it's getting serious with Ralph. He told me he wanted to give me something very special next week. And if it's what I think it is, it's about damn time. Seriously, it's about damn time? You've been seeing him for less than, like, a month. I thought Europeans were supposed to be less uptight about this sort of... Oh, oh, I see. <laughs> Woke up at 9 p.m. today. That would be strange in itself, except I don't remember going to sleep last night. In fact, I don't remember anything since last Saturday night when Ralph was over. Woke up late again. I haven't eaten anything in four days. I don't know what's wrong with me. Ralph came over. He said the reason I hadn't been eating anything is I needed blood. He said it was all I could eat now. But I wouldn't feel hungry anymore if I drank some. He had a bag from the local blood bank. I tried to refuse it, but I couldn't. What's wrong with me? What's happening? Oh my god. Ralph said he's going to have to leave soon. He said people are trying to force him out of the country. He didn't say anything about taking me with him. I had to bail Ralph out of jail today. He was arrested because his visa expired. How did he get caught? He's a fucking vampire. He's a, probably a Toreador on top of that. They should be able to talk their way out of anything. It's what they do. Nah, dip. I hadn't seen or heard Ralph since the last night I bailed him out. I don't know what to do. I thought he cared about me. Why did he do this to me? I talked to this guy I met from Surfside till 5 in this morning. When I told him I had to go, I felt like Cinderella. He seemed like a prince. I met that guy from the Surfside again. He has no idea what I am. I brought E, the guy from the Surfside, back to my apartment. He said he was going back to Australia in a few days. Now that the tournament's coming to an end. I don't want him to leave. I never felt this way about someone before, not even Rolf. He kissed me last night, and I couldn't stop myself from biting into his neck. Aw, oh, yeah, likes it rough. But I drank too much blood, and I gave him some of mine to save him. When I explained it all to him, he said he never wanted to see me again. What have I done? I haven't been able to feed since that night with E. I'm afraid it'll all happen. I remember Wolf brought blood from the blood bank. Maybe if I can sneak in, I can grab a few bags and get out before anyone catches me. Well, that's my next stop, I guess. And I gotta try and steal that bag of werewolf blood while I'm over there, so it all works out. Back to the hospital. Because no one remembers that I stole drugs. Amazingly, no one remembers. Like, it's like one night later, maybe. And I stole drugs. Oh, wait. Now that the cops aren't surrounding the building, maybe I can blackmail that doctor now. Yeah, you. How are I told you, I will get to you when I can. Please take a seat. <laughs> are you the doctor who likes to play with doctor with his nurses? Get out of here. Can't you see I'm with a patient? Your malpractice will interest your wife. Are you trying to blackmail me? I'm not trying anything. You don't I'm know succeeding. Who my wife is. She wouldn't believe you. Now get out. Perhaps Trina and Paige should trade doctor stories. Wait now. What do you want? Aw, only 75? Whatever, Dear, I'll take it. But I'm in the middle of something. I'll have to drop it off later. Now never speak to me about that again. Drop, drop the green in your office for me to harvest later. Oh well. Uh, what time is it? To be fair, I am sure he's very annoyed that I just did that. 
to be equally fair, I just don't care. This again. Just laugh hysterically for a while, it's fine. Laugh like the Joker, apparently. It's good. Whatever. Hmm. I can hack too. Uh, controlled substances. That'll be useful later, but not right now. Prescription storage. Hmm. I don't remember which room it's in. Sure. What was that? Prescription storage area. That doesn't sound right. Maybe. Yeah, sure, controlled substances. Let's try that. Well, if that camera's on, then the one. What the hell happened here? I don't remember doing that. Ah, bugger. That was close. Ah, oh, really? I think I forgot something. Oh shit! Well... Whatever. I'm fine with this. I don't have to worry about running around from the, away from the guy anymore. Well, if I can't do it that way... I know another way in that room. See, it was only a matter of time before we came into the murder. I really feel like eventually one of my minds was going to do that, regardless of my wants and desires. Control substances. Uh, I don't know the password. Let's see if we can hack it. Dosage! Oh no. It's pointless to do it from this side. Wait. I know this game. I am really good at this game. Welcome back to Vent Crawling. I'm your host, Yorick. Once again, we are out of the vent, but I feel it's only a matter of time before we return. Motherfucker. Seriously? Yorick? Ah, see? What did I tell you? No one escapes the vent for long. Not until their final crawl. Worth a try. Paige, you dirty hoe. How many people in this hospital is she banging? Souls draped in rotten tatters and father dances in the dark. Good for father. Coming up on the 20 minute mark, but we're getting that blood. I mean, we already spilled a lot of it just to get to it, so we. Ugh. And heck, 
since we no longer have to worry about the officer. Might as well steal the rest of the prescription drugs while we're here. He's gonna stop me. Get freaky, you vampirous. I don't judge. Three, huh? Alright, let's buff it. Really? Hmm. Of five? Second level last box while I'm at it. Auto levels off. How does that keep getting turned off? Well, nothing for it. Bugger. Now I'm really hungry. Now let's get out of here. I'll steal more drugs later. Much later. Wait a minute. Uh, yeah, I can go downstairs this way. Probably. And next time, we'll do that. Farewell, vampire.